Hey, everybody. John Clay, VP of Threat Intelligence here, and welcome to episode 17 of Trend Talks Threat Research. And I wanted to talk about our 2025 predictions report. So every year, Trend Micro publishes a predictions report. We uh, go and talk to our futurists and our forward-looking threat researchers and ask them to provide us some information about what trends they're, they're, that they think we will see in the coming year across whether it's the adversary's use of, of uh, malicious content uh, to what are organizations dealing with uh, around AI. So let's talk a little bit about some of the different things that we cover inside the predictions report. And by the way, I will link to the full report in the uh, description. So you can get a lot more detail than what I'm going to cover here today, but I just wanted to give you kind of a cliff note look at what is going on. So a couple of th areas that we are um, doing within the report. The first area is kind of new where we give our assessment of the risks that we see uh, associated with them, about 22 different areas that we cover. And we, we break it down by severity, which industry or group is, could be affected by this prediction, um, and then what that prediction is. So it gives you some interesting areas to look at. So again, I'm not going to go through all 22, but uh, suffice to say, if you look at the report, you'll get a lot more detail there. Um, the big area that we cover is artificial intelligence, AI and generative AI, and how the adversaries are going to be utilizing it in the coming year, whether it's through deep fakes, uh, malicious digital twins, uh, what tools are being sold by the adversaries in, the, in, their, in their marketplaces. All of that um, AI-generated content by adversaries is only going to make it a lot harder for people out there to you know, identify if something's legitimate or not. Uh, but we go into a lot of that information. We focus on the consumer a little bit in that area because we have a whole section that is um, focused on AI for the enterprise. And this actually covers some of the aspects that, that if you're adopting AI within your organization, how you can deal with the challenges that that might bring from safety use, um, security use, how to stop uh, secrets from being sent out uh, publicly, et cetera. So all of that is covered in that section as well. Another thing, Trend Micro has been doing adversary intelligence for a lot of years. And so we have a whole section on APT groups, whether that's groups from China, Russia, Iran, Korea, whatever it might be. We, we, but we, in this section, we actually look at some of the tools, tactics, and procedures that we are likely to see in 2025 uh, being used by these groups. Uh, we regularly publish content uh, on our blogs about the different groups we track. And so you can take a look at those. Um, we call them by different names. Earth is one of the ones. So Earth Estries is a big one that we looked at just recently. Um, they're also called Salt Typhoon. So you can see a lot of that. But, that, but the report's going to go into a lot of the predictions around that area. Um, another area, obviously, is with our zero-day initiative agnostic bug bounty program, which is the biggest in the world. We get a lot of vulnerability intelligence uh, from that organization, as well as a lot of our internal vulnerability researchers. So whether it's pre-disclosure, post-disclosure, we're going to give you a lot of information about the types of vulnerabilities, even full classes of vulnerabilities that are likely to be exploited by these adversaries in the, in the future. Um, one of the things that happened recently is one of the uh, gray market groups, uh, got taken down or just left the industry uh, business. And so they aren't selling uh, zero days anymore. So we're likely going to see a shift in that market for sure. So uh, interesting area that's happening. And then ransomware. Uh, we obviously have a whole section on ransomware because it does cause lots of problems. It'll continue to be problematic for a lot of organizations out there. So we, we want to give you some insights into what we're going to expect from ransomware attacks in 2025. So we'll give you some, some good detail about that as well. And then lastly, we look at some of the attack tools, the living off the land tools that the 
um, adversaries are going to be utilizing. We look at even like malvertisement that is making a comeback out there. Uh, but we we look at a lot of that information, give you a lot of information about what you can expect to see in 2025 in that area. So those are some of the areas that we cover in the report. Like I said, I would recommend you download the report or look at the um, online version. And again, I'll link to it in the description. Uh, but I'll give you a lot more details about all of these areas and give you some some good insights. We also obviously give you some good best practices and what you can do in 2025 to um, help prevent these attacks. Uh, I'll give you a preview there is one of the things that we are looking at is shifting in the industry is going from that best of breed model, which hasn't been working for quite a long time to more of a platform approach and really focusing on attack surface risk management tied in collaborative work with our uh, XDR tools that are native XDR tools, but uh, we also have third-party support within our Vision One platform. And so uh, you can take advantage of that. You might want to check that out if you haven't yet. Uh, that really is showing good promise for our customers who have adopted it and are helping to prevent these breaches and these attacks from occurring. So that's it. Uh, thanks for listening to episode 17 of Trend Talks Threat Research. I'll be back in a couple of weeks to give you uh, some more information about a new piece of research that Trend Micro has published. But you can always go to trendmicro.com and go into our research section. Lots of information there, whether it's blogs, reports, videos, whatever it might be, to give you what is going on within the threat uh, landscape today and in the near future. So thanks, everybody. Stay safe, stay healthy, and we'll talk soon. Bye-bye.